Okay, yeah, so my name is Erin Riley, and I'm weaving right now, tapestry weaving, um, on a loom. And I use wool and like pretty traditional techniques. It's like a 30-year-old machine. So I find a lot of images online. I've been looking for um, snapshots and sort of like Tumblr, vulnerable images you'd think someone took for their boyfriend or girlfriend. So like private things. And then also um, I've been doing a lot of object pieces where kind of like these still lives of drug use and kind of just like the fun people have. So I've been collecting like bongs and um, condoms and tampons and all those kind of the gritty things of life. What's left of something is mostly just like the trash or the smell or like the stains of things. So. You know, growing up on the internet, you're always taking pictures of yourself and sending them or emailing them or chat, AOL, instant messaging. That was kind of how I felt comfortable communicating with guys I was, you know, interested in or starting to date. So that was just like a comfortable language of communication and sort of like flirting. You take a picture where you look great and you send it to a guy and he just wants another one. And I think like that's something that I, growing up, you kind of, come to accept, but as a young person I was always like, really? You know, you need another picture of me? So with weaving, it's kind of like giving the picture the time. With tapestry weaving, you're really slowing these images down and devoting like, you know, two weeks, three weeks of your life to dyeing the colors and weaving it all together. The three, the three shirts work together because like I've always done these three themes of figures, objects, and landscape, and the guns are kind of like this, um, kind of what I think of like men's objects, and like this kind of aggressive thing, but also beautiful and detailed and personal, um, and the girl in her American flag underwear is just sort of so classically like what I think of when I look at um, college girls, are just kind of this like natural beauty and... Um, in Americana, like right now, it's like a really sweet image of um, like kind of sexuality and just like a crotch shot. And um, and then the third image is from the Highway Memorial series that I've been doing with um, roadside crosses and then just like a landscape of trees and the road and all that. Yeah, I mean it's kind of surreal to see stuff like printed or because it does go through this um, process of kind of a photograph that becomes simplified and input into my own language and then into the tapestry language and then it's on a t-shirt. So I kind of like having my work seen in a different context because so many people's responses are different to the pieces and um, yeah, I mean I'm curious to see what these pieces, like especially the Highway Memorial piece, which is a really serious image, um, ends up looking like, you know, on a, at a skate park or, you know, something like that. So, you know, wiping sweat off someone's face or something.